got a very sad phone call. Pretty young girl from Zambia, you know that she ain't with the drama. Light skin girl Osama, you know she the bomb, she cause trauma. Hey guys, welcome back to or welcome to my channel. Hi, my name is Yamba and I create YouTube content which you should subscribe to. Okay, so welcome to a new vlog. This is like a week in my life type of situation i'm so excited because today is sunday the 8th of may it's mother's day as well happy mother's day to all the mothers out there who watch me you're much appreciated <laughs> i am heading to bristol and i'm so excited because i haven't been there since literally the pandemic hit so march 2020 well i left on the first of april but whatever so yeah i'm pretty excited my graduation isn't till wednesday but that's gonna be like a whole separate vlog i'm sure you've already seen it so yeah i'm just super excited i thought i'll bring you guys along and we should have quite the fun week enjoy hey guys so a brief little intermission to talk about a data saving app called let's chat thank you so much to let's chat for sponsoring a portion of today's video so what it is is based basically an app that you use to send messages, voice call, video call, group call, all of that jazz. And it's currently available to all my Z users on all networks, whether MTN, Airtel, Zamtel, whichever. But for now, it's only available in the Google Play Store. And since it's football season, Let's Chat is running a campaign from the 24th of May at 6 p.m. to the 28th of May at 9.30 p.m. called the UCL Predict and Win. So that's basically the UEFA Champions League Predict and Win. So you basically get to to predict who's gonna win it and they're giving a combined total of a million kwacha worth of airtime and also authentic football jerseys so to enter the competition to stand yourself a chance of winning a share of the 1 million kwacha worth of airtime as well as football jerseys make sure you download the let's chat app and go into the events page where you can predict and win and they also have other challenges that you can participate in that increase your chances of winning so yeah, all the best you guys. <laughs> Don't forget to download Let's Chat using the link in my description box. Thank you so much to Let's Chat for sponsoring this portion of today's video. Wake up to you in the morning You tell me how you feel it Seem like your body don't know how to hold you So maybe I can instead You got so many battles you don't need to fight Feel it with you every time it isn't feeling right I wish I could take your pain I could take your pain I've never seen in life You hurt them but it don't show on the outside Then repeat it every day But you're my, my lady You're my baby You're my baby So anything you got is mine You guys, I'm in Bristol I don't even know how to act Like I haven't been here in so long I miss it so much and yeah, I'm vlogging on my phone because my camera is not that far, but I just can't be bothered to get it. But oh my god, you guys, I want to cry. That is mine, so the next time. Guys, excuse my appearance, but I made it to Mahmoud. So I'm just out here on the balcony. He brought me food, like he made me a sandwich. And these are like desserts that they had from Ramadan, he said. And they're really good, I had a couple. So yeah, I'm just like so happy to be back. Let me show you my view. You don't feel right. Ain't gonna be a next time. I'ma take the pain and trade you for some. Better days, but they ain't better. Better life. Hey. Hey. I'm so glad 
to have you. Yeah. <laughs> you haven't been on the vlog in like three or more years. Exactly. Crazy. The next morning. You guys, I finally bought a steamer and I'm so happy about it. This is adulting. I'm so happy. <laughs> guys i hope i'm like i can't see okay hey guys happy monday i was about to say tuesday no it's monday and it's a beautiful day today i love the like the weather here is so nice you guys it's giving summer i love it i love it it is about to be 2 p.m right now it's like quarter to two and i got a very sad phone call basically my dad facetimed me and told me that they won't be able to make it for my graduation because their visas aren't out yet today was like the last day for them to be out in order for them to like make it because grad is on wednesday but yeah that's not happening so he called me and he's like in your words it sucks and i'm like it does it really does but hey what can you do about it c'est la vie i guess and i was literally telling someone just earlier today I'm like everything happens for a reason because they missed their flight last night so I'm like everything happens for a reason so now I have to like tell myself that everything happens for a reason I guess my parents didn't make it for my high school graduation either because they both had to travel for work and then I was like now history's repeated itself and my mom's like now you have to do another degree so we can make it <laughs> and I'm like how are we so sure <laughs> but yeah there's that so I was just kind of like mm about it but now i'm like let me just get ready i have things to do today i need to go get my nails done first of all i'm excited about that i haven't gotten them done in a while and then i'm just gonna walk around bristol i need to go to primark and the shops and like habit circus and all of that then just chill by the harbor side and whatnot i might come take photos later we'll see anyway i'm just going with the flow but the main thing i have to do is yeah my nails and get what i need to get from primark so i will stop chatting i'm gonna get ready i'm doing my makeup on the balcony like how cute <laughs> Child, i'm not about to get my white shirt dirty <laughs> before i even step out 10 seconds later not me using the wrong brush how's your day going i just used my powder brush for foundation I just need to clean up. Okay, I fixed it. It looks so much better now. that 
that Colson statue that was thrown into the harbor side. This is where it used to be. Now it's not, it's not existent. We love to see it. We love to see it. And if you could read my mind. This right here is testing my vlog shyness in public. I don't know if I said it to the vlog, but I'm trying to not be so vlog shy because even though I've been doing this for a while, I still do get vlog shy. You'd be shocked. I'm just walking through the corner right now, which is just like the shopping corner. And yeah, I went to Typo, went to Zara, I got a couple items or whatever. Now I'm about to go into Super Jug. I just need to get like, um, I think I need a primer. Not I think, I know I need a primer. Or I don't need it, I want it, then I need like eyebrow stuff, so that's why we're here. No need to be stressed, gotta take it home, there. I really miss the shame. I literally swear by this, this dual brow definer. Like this is what, it won't even focus, but this right here, my holy grail, literally. There we go. This is so good and it's so affordable. Love it. the next day hey guys happy tuesday it is t minus one day till graduation i'm just walking into town to meet up with my sisters claire and jane and yeah we're gonna have brunch so hey that was so cute <laughs> hey girl <laughs> Way. I don't have to wash the way the pain with liquid courage, 
updated you guys in a little while it's like half past three now finished having cute brunch of claire and jane a while ago and yeah i just walked to come check into the studio apartment so i'm staying in the studio for two nights i'm just gonna give you guys a room tour <laughs> Because yeah, I don't even have my luggage or anything because I haven't been back home yet So I just figured out check in just come check out the place and then go get my stuff bring it back all those shenanigans Basically, so let me give you guys a quick tour now. So I walk in and this is the entire space So over here we just have like a coat rack with some hangers always handy you have <laughs> your phone on here i have this mirror you can't even see me i'm so short <laughs> um yeah you have your little table over here um nice art piece or whatever you have your little bedside table with the lamp on there we have the bed which is so cute and then there's actually another stand on there over here we have your little couch you have your radiator obviously tv chest of drawers i don't even know what the view is it's not much it's the view of prince street basically <laughs> and then over here you obviously have your little kitchenette which should have like essentials in it yeah your cups in there your plates and whatnot no it's up here Ooh, we got pots if we're trying to cook, which we're not. <laughs> yeah, you basically just have like all your little trinkets and stuff. This is such a cute sink. Stop it. <laughs> Ooh, it's a dishwasher. Stop. We have our fridge. What's over here? Oh, it's just a, yeah, boiler. Oh my gosh, a hob. It reminds me of when I lived in a studio in like first year of uni and I had a hob exactly like this, like two plates, just like this. Oh, the little oven. This is so cute. It's so cute. And then we have more like hooks on there. We'll go to this door first. Oh, this is just like a, oh, it's a closet. Like we have more closet space and just like your utilities and stuff, vacuum, wah, wah, wah. Then in here is the bathroom. Is this the cutest bathroom I've ever seen? Definitely not. I don't like this green. It's kind of like, it's giving hospital, but I guess it will do. <laughs> and yeah, it is I, it is me. And then yeah, this is just the bathroom. You have your toilet, radiator, sink, shower. You know I hate when like hotels and stuff do this. Like why put green when you could just have made it white or something or silver or like something neutral, you know what I mean? Yeah, anyway, whatever, so. That is it. Also, first things first, gotta connect to Wi-Fi, so that's what I'm doing. <laughs> also, the lighting in here is so good. I specifically requested for a studio that was south-facing, that had south-facing windows, just so that the lighting would be good for me to take my photos and film and all of that, so just content creator things. Also, I just noticed that there's no full length mirror in here and it's just like, bro, there's so much space to put a full length mirror, but that isn't a thing, I guess. I'm using my little teensy weensy bag today and whenever people see this they're like oh my gosh can you even carry anything in there but literally it carries the essentials let me show you here's a segment of what's in my bag <laughs> basically i have my lip gloss right my card holder which has all my cards like id bank cards all of that and down at the bottom is a pad so what more do you need really things like the phone go in your hands keys in your hands like you're good to go with your little miniature bag or if you want to be more safe put those in the pocket over there <laughs> let's go now it's literally so nostalgic walking around this neighborhood because i used to live like 
down that way and yeah I'm not gonna go there because it's just too far out of my way but these are like my everyday stomping grounds and this right here is a UE building that we had class in like a couple times also this is like my favorite part of the harbor side I think it's the busiest but it's my favorite for whatever reason I'd usually just come sit like over there like literally by the harbor side like feet dangling good times good times <laughs> Found a mirror over here, period, period. Look at the fit, look at the fit, yes. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> So a little backstory to what's happening here is that my suit came as a two piece like I had to order the pieces separately so I ordered the pants first and then the blazer later but it turns out that I ordered the wrong pants so last minute I had to order the correct pants and I didn't know which size I was going to be whether a four or a six so I ordered both of them and then returned one of them so the four is what ended up fitting and yeah I returned the six and then I kept the other pants like the wrong ones that I got because I got them resized just me casually walking with all these things in my hands because like I said I chose to be cute and use a little bag <laughs> but the pants fit yay <laughs> the next day so I literally just remembered wait let me finish chewing this is bad etiquette I just remembered that I was also filming this vlog <laughs> So yeah, today I focus on the graduation one. Obviously, if you haven't already seen that, go back and watch it, okay? It was really good. It was just the rain that threw me all the way off and threw it off, but it was nice regardless. So currently, it's like 9, like 9.40 basically, it's 9.37. I'm having a Tesco meal deal. I've never had this one, the fajita chicken sub, apparently it's limited edition. It's pretty nice though. But yeah, grad was good, I'm just really tired from the day, but I felt the love and everything. Yeah, it was good. Before I started eating, I was just laid down for a couple hours, but now I'm about to go to Mahmoud's just to hang out with them for a bit since it's my last night here and I'll still see him tomorrow because we're having I don't know like coffee or lunch or something with Rebecca our former lecturer <laughs> but yeah she's like a friend of ours but yeah for now I'm just gonna go like hang out at the house with everyone so yeah much 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 later my ears literally look like Dumbo's ears right now but <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna vlog anymore for the evening, but I thought I'd just update you guys. I came back home a while ago. It is way past midnight right now. I need to check the time, but I know it's past midnight. It's half past midnight. It's actually my bedtime, so my phone is in sleep mode. But I'm currently packing because checkout is at 10 a.m. and I'm not trying to be packing in the morning. So this is our current situation. Yeah, we basically just need to pack everything. I'll pack my toiletries tomorrow. That's fine, but I just want to pack everything else, my makeup and whatnot, and move the table back to where it was, move that chair back to where it was and yeah the next morning it is officially checkout time now i'm just making sure the windows are locked oh this lighting was so nice i'm glad they actually listened to me because like i said earlier i requested for specific why am I not in focus? Anyway, yeah, as I was saying, like I said earlier in the vlog, I, I requested for specific windows because I need a good lighting. So I'm glad they did that. So yeah, pretty much packed up now. It is time to go. You guys, we're back on campus and <laughs> I haven't been here in so long. Like literally, wait, you can't even see me. <laughs> yeah, I haven't been back here since I think 2019, like French A. 
I have not. <laughs> so yeah, it's so nice to be back. I'm just like, I'm being a tourist on my own campus. <laughs> you guys, right there is where Mahmoud and I met. <laughs> right? That's the international college where it all began. <laughs> Mahmoud was just telling me that's a new engineering building that was not here when I was here. That's the SU, the students here. Business building, aka X Block. to this gorgeous gorgeous view now oh it's time to go oh, I know, yeah. oh it's been so nice but yeah time to go home.